the Bible Belt, literally, tomorrow. I don't think that it's really good as far as because kids are riding the bus, and that's not showing a good thing for the kids. Ads on Fort Worth buses target those good without God. That's an individual's choice. That's not my choice, but that's an individual's choice. The ungodly message is one you won't see in Dallas because DART won't put it on their buses. The 33's Duarte Geraldino talked to a local group behind the ad. He joins us live now from Fort Worth with more. Duarte. The group says the ads are designed to promote acceptance of people who do not believe in God. In just a few days, thousands of people here in Fort Worth will see ads on buses that equate being without God as good. Advertisements on buses deliver all sorts of messages. Hunger is here, hot and bothered. And starting next week, a controversial ad will be zipping around Fort Worth. Millions of Americans are good without God. I don't think that it's, it's really good as far as because kids are riding the bus. Exactly. And that's not showing a good thing for the kids. Denise Havert frequently rides the bus with her son. She believes the city is making a mistake allowing four buses to carry the ads. The Dallas-Fort Worth Coalition of Reason paid $2,500 to have the ads run for 30 days. Coalition spokesperson Terry McDonald says the ads are designed to encourage non-believers to feel comfortable and come out of the closet. In our area, we're so inundated with uh, religious messages that uh, sometimes we who are not believers kind of get overwhelmed. Some writers take no issue with the ads. That's an individual's choice. That's not my choice, but that's an individual's choice. A Fort Worth Transportation Authority spokesperson tells the 33 News that T strives to be fair to all parties in accepting advertising and not to discriminate among faiths or beliefs. But some writers believe that T is making a mistake. You know, I know a lot of people that ride the bus and the train that are very religious, and they're not going to appreciate that at all. And I could see them losing ridership from that. The coalition says by stressing, quote, millions of Americans are good without God, it is trying to show everyone that it is no different and that the number of non-believers is constantly growing. We're just like everybody else. We're taxpaying, law-abiding citizens, and we're just as good as anybody else. In the past, the coalition has put up similar messages on billboards. One read, don't believe in God, you're not alone. It says its campaign won't soon end. The coalition tried to put similar ads in on Dallas buses, but DART wouldn't allow it. DART says it no longer allows faith-based ads on its buses. In Fort Worth, Duarte Geraldino, The 33 News.